allowance. As in, I'm allowing you to keep 10%, and I'm allowing you to keep drawing breath on this earth. Now, you either get down, or you lay down. What's it gonna be, sunshine? This wasn't no movie. The smart thing was to say yes, get up, and leave the room. But then I thought to myself, what if this was a movie? Look, you, the plane you flew in on, them shoes, your socks with the bell on it, your gay ass accent, them cheap ass cigars, your yuck mouth teeth, your hair piece, your chocolate, Guy Ritchie, Prince William, the queen. This is America. My president is black and my Lambo is blue, nigga. Now get the out of my hotel room. And if I see you in the street, I'm slapping the out of you. Alright, niggas and niggets, I got a battle here against Mega7588, found him off of Abra's Asylum, and this is a mixed battle. He was asking for a battle on there, and I said, what kind? He said, mix. I said, sure, because I don't fucking mix battle, so it'll be interesting as hell to try. So, I let off my Needle Queen, he let off with his Hitmon top, I went straight for damage, he predicted that went to this Clay Doll, psyched me, that did a fuckload. I thought that it was a standard Clay Doll, so I went for the Taunt, and that was completely fail. I set up my fucking Bankai, Bankai, or however, and I take whatever special attacks he throw at me, and I know he's gonna switch here, so I set up the wish, cause I'm wishing, I wish upon a star, na -na -na. that was fail, but he sends out this Luxray, and I'm thinking the only reason he sent out this Luxray is because he has Crunch, but he has Toxic. So that was, I'm thinking that this is probably a defensive Luxray, which is fucking nice to battle. Because I never fucking battle them. I never battle Luxrays, period. But anyway, this is a mixed battle, so what do you, what can you expect? Um, so yeah, you turned out into my Grim Jow, which is my Infernape, and I'm gonna Fire Blast that, that, um, fucking Luxray to Waco Mundo. Anyway, um, he sends out this clay doll, and I fear the earth power here, but he goes for the charge beam, so now that I know this is an offensive clay doll, and is perhaps a charge beam sweeper, which is another fucking poke I don't battle at all. So, yeah, he, this was a fun battle, because I'm battling pokes that I never really battle too much, and it was just a nice battle to have someone, uh, have a good battle with a nice person. Um, anyway... He goes for the Earth Power, predicting me to go back into Needle Queen. So that was just a good prediction on his part. And I'm going to U-turn out here as he switches into this Hitmon top, and he gets the Intimidate on me, so U-turn won't do really anything. And yeah, um, like I said, I'm battling Mega 75-88, and this is a mixed battle. I send out my Hypno, thinking that I can probably wall this thing, so I go for the T-Wave. And he goes for the bulk up, so I know that this is a bulk up Hitmon top, which is nice to see again because I don't battle them at all. And yup, yeah, here I set up a wish as he gets Parahack, which is gay. And I is going to switch here, and he goes for pursuit. So I was like, oh shit, that scared the fuck out of me. I thought that was gonna kill my ass. But, um, I live with basically around half, and I sent, sent, sent in my, um, Weezing, which can basically wall this hit my top all day. I went for a will wisp predicting the switch, he doesn't switch, so that was fail. I went for another will wisp predicting the switch, but he doesn't switch, so that was fail. So I'm like, alright, this nigga ain't gonna switch no more. Because if he ain't switched twice, it's no point in him switching no more. So, um, I go for a fire blast, and that did shit damage. So I'm like, alright. I know what this is. This is probably max special defense, max HP. I used to run a max special defense, max HP hit my top, and it was win. So this is what this is, and probably with um bulk up to raise defenses as well. And this is exactly what it is. So this is probably a this is a mini Star War um, here, and I'm gonna take this time to tell you all to go check out Rocket Game Corner. That just a cool place where I um, I, um, I just basically be chilling at and shit be talking to other people just having a good time or whatever like if you just want a place to just chill out at it and not have no fucking hassles with no bitch ass niggas just come out to rocket game corner and you can just have a chill ass time chill place to be but anyway let's get back to the battle 
yeah, uh, I'm almost done killing this hit my top off, which is nice because that was just long and kind of boring. But yeah, so I go for another fire blast and doesn't fucking take it out, which kind of pissed me off. I was like, what the fuck? Can you just fucking die already? And I think it lives with like probably like 2 HP, 4 HP, 10 HP, whatever. I go for a T-Bolt here and that's going to take it out because it basically has no HP left. <sighs> so that's one dead hit my top. And he sends out the clay doll, trying to scare me off with a psychic. I predict him to over predict, and he went for the old power, earth power, which was a great prediction on my part. And I'm going to explode on his ass. So that clay doll is dead, and that probably sealed the fate of the upcoming turns ahead. Anyway, I sent out my scissor, and he sends out this fucking skarmory, and I'm like, whoa, drill peck. Then I see the life orb, so I'm like, god damn, that drill peck did a fuckload. And even though I'm max HP, so that did a dick cum load. A cum dick load. So I sent out my fucking, um, Infernape here. I go for Fire Blast Mist, doesn't matter because he switched into a Flygon. Well, kind of did matter, as you'll see upcoming. Um, goes for the EQ on my Hypno, and that's gonna take it out. <coughs> Didn't think it would take me out, thought I would, like, live, but whatever. Uh, I sent out my Polito thinking that he's probably Scarf, but he goes with a T-Punch, so that scared the fuck out of me. So now I was thinking it was Expert Belted, but it takes me a little bit over half. So I know that two T-Punches won't kill me, and I'll be able to kill this Flygon with an Ice Beam. But at least that's what I thought, but it has a fucking Focus Sash. I hate, I hate Focus Sash. I hate it. Only when I'm using it, it's good. But anyway, uh, he goes for the Outrage. Outrage is not going to take me out, and I'm going to be able to kill it off of the Surf, which is nice. So that's one dead Flygon, and yep, he sends out this Skarm, which is Life Orb, which is kind of interesting to face, I mean, never faced one of these shits before, and the person I was battling said that he's a custom trainer, and he uses custom sets and all that shit, and kind of worked out for him in this battle, and was just a good battle to, um, to fight and shit. So now, um, if the Fire Blast hits, I win, if it doesn't hit, I lose. It hits, so that means I win. He has a Magby left. I'm like, what the fuck? You have a Magby? Why do you have a Magby? He has an error. Don't ask me. Ask him. See you guys later. Oh. <laughs> 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 yeah, that's good.